Sunlight is a portion of the electromagnetic radiation given off by the sun. In particular, these are infrared, visible, and ultraviolet light. On Earth, sunlight is scattered and filtered through Earth's atmosphere and is obvious as daylight when the sun is above the horizon. Sunlight is essential for human health and well-being. The health benefits of sunlight include generating the production of vitamin D, supporting bone health, lowering blood pressure, preventing disease, and promoting good mental health. Sunlight and darkness trigger the release of hormones in your brain. Exposure to sunlight is thought to increase the brain's release of a hormone called serotonin. Serotonin is associated with boosting mood and helping a person feel calm and focused. Drying your clothes in the sun is still the most energy efficient method. Since the sun is a giant nuclear reactor, you can brag to your friends that you have a nuclear powered clothes dryer. New research shows that sunlight kills potentially harmful bacteria and improves air quality in indoor environments. Sunlight is known to lower blood pressure. What they found is that nitric oxide stored in the top layers of the skin reacts to sunlight and causes blood vessels to widen as the oxide moves into the bloodstream. That in turn lowers blood pressure. Sunlight triggers production of vitamin D, which in turn has been shown to help reduce the risk of dying from breast, colon, prostate and lung cancers. Plants use photosynthesis to convert light energy into chemical energy. When light hits a plant's leaves, CO2 from the air reacts with water in the plant to create sugar and oxygen. If you live in a country where your local water supply is unsafe, you can use the sun to disinfect water by filtering muddy water, filling plastic pop bottles and leaving them out in the sun for at least 6 hours. The sun's ultraviolet rays will kill any bacteria or organisms. Solar technology converts sunlight into electrical energy either through photovoltaic PV panels or through mirrors that concentrate solar radiation. This energy can be used to generate electricity or be stored in batteries or thermal storage. When an architect designs a passive solar home, they make the most of the sun's light and heat by using south-facing windows, maximizing insulation on the north, and creating a thermal mass to store solar heat. In my conclusion, life as we know it would not be possible without the heat and light of the sun. Through the process of photosynthesis, the sun along with water and carbon dioxide enables plants to grow. In turn, the carbohydrates in plants form the primary source of energy for humans and many of other life forms. Without sunlight, our earth would be nothing but a frozen giant bowl at such a lower temperature in space. Without sun, the sunlight which is a source of energy will get vanished.